Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Kill Red. Today I'm playing Banjo and Kazooie, one of my favorite games ever made. I have a hard time trying to figure out if Kazooie is the laziest one or the hardest working one. Because on one end, Kazooie, she's getting beat up throughout this whole game because Banjo's like throwing her around. He's like smacking things into her. He's breaking her fucking beak. Um, she does fly, so that's not very lazy, but on the other hand, Banjo's like running everywhere. She never uses her legs, unless I tell her to, so, I don't know. Weird relationship we got going on here. I think that they're codependent. If they're married, they probably need to go to some sort of therapy, because I'm, I'm not sure if that that's very healthy. I, th I think... I think Kazooie really needs an identity of her own. This is like the Mona Lisa of gaming right here. I don't know if you guys are aware, but... Everybody knows what Spiral Mountain is. This, this is Mo the Mona Lisa by Picasso. So I need, I need a puzzle piece. I don't know, this one's gonna be pretty tricky. I'm not sure if I can figure this one out. Grunty really is the unsung hero in this game. You know why? Because her plans are such shit that Banjo can just come in without really uh trying and just fuck them up <laughs> ever since i played this game i knew one day if my sister's ever kidnapped and i have to go into an evil witch's lair i'm gonna have to do an amazing amount of puzzles and I've, i practiced that skill over time bring it on bitch all right yes hell yeah that was really easy i remember as a kid that used to scare the shit out of me Yo, Chimpy, can you help me find my sister? That'd be cool. I just gave you an orange. That was really hard to find. I had to go on a long, treacherous journey. Can you please... Chimpy. <laughs> I love that. She's like... <laughs> shooting them out of my butt. That sounds painful. Kazooie! <laughs> You're pushing them up through your esophagus to shoot them out of your mouth. Man, just like, you gotta do it! It's for my sister! <laughs> and no, that wasn't a sucking dick noise for your information. So before you comment that, I'm not sucking dick. I was choking on eggs. Hell yeah, another one. Thank you. This is so amazing. I love this first level. It's so, so fucking great. I love it. I don't even need to try. I remember when I was a kid... My parents would come down and they get, wow, my kid, my kid is so smart. He can play Nintendo 64 games and work a calculator. Holy shit. Wow, he's figuring out all these puzzles. No, mom. I'm pressing the E button. That's all I'm doing. Your name's Nipper? Whoa. <laughs> kind of a ballsy name there, buddy. I don't know if that's going to fly in the year 2021. No. Stop it, Nipper. Dude, chill. I'm just coming... I'm coming to say hi to you. I'm coming to say hi. You think it's fucking oh <laughs> There we go. Your beautiful eyes. You're dead. Now I'm gonna go in there to finish you off. There we go. Fuck yes. We got the jiggy. I gotta find Oh no, not the shark! No, please. Snacker smells tasty dinner. That's your fucking name? No, please! Please, what a scary name. Don't. Snacker, no. Snacker, Snacker, no snacking. No snacking. Go away, Snacker. Thank you, Snacker. Fucking ghost shark. Follow the clues if you're good, looking for good. The clue is literally an arrow, bro. That's not... That's not a clue. You're just telling me where to go. See that? There's the... This is the easiest treasure ever. I always never understood this. There needs to be a pirate union. Was there ever one of those? Maybe we need to look into it. I don't know. Arr, we need a union. Army mateys, we need a union of pirates. Who is gonna stand up for the little guy? Arr, we need a better <laughs> health insurance. <laughs> Where is this fucking eggs? I was just bitching about how th you could you you would never hide anything with an eggs. Oh my gosh, it was right there. How did I miss that? I missed the fucking red X that I was just complaining about. Wow. Bam. You'll never find me now. It's right there. Bro. Open me gently, Banjo. 
BAM! Fuck you! I, I need to get people... Really what I need is I need to be so likable that people start getting rad, red tattoos on their ass. And I don't mean like baboon butts. Like, not the whole ass. I just mean like my face. And what I, what I would like, what I think would be the best advertisement is if everybody got out there and mooned people. That, none of that is a real uh, suggestion. <laughs> I'm just joking though. I'm totally joking, FBI. <laughs> I'm not, I don't, I don't, I don't like that. I don't like public nudity. Oh, <laughs> that's a big boy. He gave probably everybody nightmares um, when they were kids. And even to this day as an adult, I think it's a little fucked up. This is the main issue right here, is the swimming. Now, the swimming is not the worst thing in Banjo-Kazooie. There are definitely games that do this worse. But, it's not my favorite. And there's a particular part, which is right here. Where I have to, like, touch these bubbles. Oh, shit. Like, Mr. Gloop is gonna, um, shoot these out at me and help me out. But, but, uh, uh, I can't fucking, I can't see anything because of the camera, which is a problem. And I can't move the camera either. And I also have to keep air, which is, it, it's very obnoxious. I don't know how little... Little Red did this. Fuck. Okay, cool. I jiggled the key. That's all I need. Do I, can I just go through it again? I think so. Can I just go through it? Yes! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just, just, just give Clanker that sweet, sweet freedom, please. Please, Gruntilda, just, just, I'm, I'm so happy that you left the key in there. Yes! Fuck yes! That was the easiest time I've ever had doing that! Thank you, God! Thank you! Whoever is watching over me right now, all my ancestors, thank you so much. Hey, Clanker, I think you, um, I think you got some raspberry jam on you, bro. I don't know what this is, bro, but it looks like raspberry jam, bro. Open up, my baby. Come on, just give me a little bit. There we go. Superman 64 time, bitch. No, please, stop. Bam. We're doing this. Please, come on, just give me this. Yes! Yes! No! No! 18 seconds, please! I can do it. I can do it. I'm not even worried. Let's see. Okay, so there's that one. This is the last one. Five. Yes! Fuck yes! Another jiggy. Alright, so, I think that that's all I need for Clinker's Cavern. I'm gonna be honest, a part of me just wants to give her 2D, and then I could date Grunty. If I let her have my sister... I could have a fine-ass green woman. It's a complicated one. I, I'm not quite sure what I would do in that situation. I'm, th I'm thinking, ah, oh, man, that's really hard. Give up my sister. Fine-ass green lady. The green, it kind of throws it off a little bit. But, fine-ass. I want whatever's in this egg, and I don't think it's a fetus. Yes! Thank you. Jiggy, baby. I knew that it was a Jiggy and not a fetus. Just keep your smelly feet out of our swamp. No! Okay, I'm being attacked by all sides. Every creature in the jungle hates me. This is so scary. This is one of my favorite parts of the game, though. Because they just, like, attack you out of nowhere. Come out of the swamp. I know that your buddies are gone. But you gotta be a man. Step up to the plate. Fight me! Fight me like a man! Die like a man! There we go. That's right! I took out the whole fucking flip it mafia right there. Nobody can stop me now. Oh, hey. This is not what I thought it was. Shit. Shit, son. I love this level, actually. These later levels in Banjo are like the shit. I think this is what most people remember when they talk about Banjo and Kazooie, at least the first one. I'm super excited to play the rest of this for for you guys, with you guys. We're going to have a lot of fun. Please let me know if you liked this, uh, this video. Comment, rate, subscribe. I know that I've been gone for like a month. I plan to come back. We're going to try and do weekly videos again because we enjoy making content for you guys. Um, let me know how this went. Thank you for coming and watching me again. You guys have a good day.